Because many of them are. Um, some of them aren't. But this notion that the wealthy in our society are always and entirely defined by things that they just inherited, they didn't do, um, seems to be misleading. I've sort of been persuaded by the readers to say the successful and wealthy. The reason I won't just say wealthy is because I don't want to end up in a sort of class war situation and because I don't begrudge the wealth of people who, who've, who've done great things. I don't begrudge Steve Jobs uh, his, his wealth or his legacy. I don't begrudge Bill Gates or and many other entrepreneurs amazing good fortune in terms of material benefits. I feel sorry for them a bit because I think that kind of money is, is a horrible uh, curse in a way to a life of ordinary living and of, and of real living, but I don't envy them. Um, and I certainly think that allowing them to keep uh, a fair amount of what they produce is, is only just. And I think that punishing people for producing more or more innovatively than others by confiscating their money at higher and higher rates is, is not the kind of signal that government should be giving to wealth creators in this country or anywhere for that matter. I think it's unjust in other words. I think it's wrong to take from people what they have openly and meritocratically deserved. Um, having said that, of course, um, I do think that pragmatically you can make a decision in terms of the need to raise funds for covering a big deficit or debt or in looking at, for example, the way the tax code favors the extremely wealthy um, by allowing even successful to avoid taxes that other people have to pay. That, that is also unjust um, and we should fix that. So I believe really in, in simplification of taxes. Um, and I also believe in celebrating those who create wealth and jobs and change the way we live through their own imagination, determination, and hard work. Uh, so it's, you know, it's a mix. I think with a conservative it's always going to be a mix. It's always going to be a general principle in many ways that is tempered by a particular context. Um, and in this particular case, um, I'm all in favor of the wealthy. I think right now we need them to chip in more.